Well, there's one art prize entry at Mel Trotter Park that hopes to change your perspective on people who are experiencing homelessness. It's called A Walk in Their Shoes, showing how people find themselves in a homeless situation. News 8's Heather Walker went to Mel Trotter to get the message behind this entry and the impact that it could have. This exhibit allows people to walk through and see some of the experiences that lead people to homelessness. So we're really trying to dispel myths and stereotypes about people who are experiencing homelessness through this journey. Because what do most people think? A lot of people think it's your old white drunk man. A lot of people think it's drug addicts. Um, so that's only about four. Lazy people. Lazy people. Only about 4% of the population of people experiencing homelessness have addiction. Um, so 4%? Yes. Heather Osterink with Mel Trotter Ministries explains she says experiencing homelessness because it shouldn't define people. Instead, it's a stop on their life journey. This exhibit shows the five most prevalent paths to homelessness by five different artists. This one in particular um, depicts mental illness. Um, and oftentimes when you're dealing with mental illness, there's a loss of job. A picture here, this is detailing um, someone who had a successful business and was injured and could not afford to pay medical bills, could not work anymore and lost everything. Um, we've actually had several guests who've stated our mission where that's happened to them. There's also a piece on domestic violence depicting the large number of women who end up without a place to stay after leaving an abusive relationship. I, I wish that everybody would just try to understand that it's not us to judge, but it is us to take care of everybody and love everybody as much as we can. LGBTQ kids shunned from their families also make up a large part of the homeless population. It's, it's simply that they have something that's different that's excluding them from the family and the relationships that they know. And then over here we have um, Lost in the Storm. And this is depicting suburban loss. Believe it or not, uh, homelessness is in the suburbs. Mel Trotter says some families living paycheck to paycheck can lose everything with one unexpected bill, pointing out that homelessness is more about lack of relationships than anything else. If you think about yourself or myself, I have a lot of family. I have a lot of people I could turn to before I would ever have to end up in the streets. Some people aren't as fortunate. You could be homeless, I could be homeless, and anybody could be homeless. And we just don't pay attention to that. And it's, just, it's the wrong thing to do. We need to start taking care of people. The exhibit is located right across from Mel Trotter on Commerce if you'd like to check it out. Reporting in downtown Grand Rapids, Heather Walker, News 8.